Hello, and uh, welcome back. It's still the same day of recording, not uh, many episodes later. And uh, yeah, last time we did some hunting, had a little bit of fun. Oh, that was cool. I love the storms in this game. So good. Look at them trees bend. Yeah, we did some hunting and uh, whatnot. Got us some uh, equipment, like the bow. Currently out here hunting deer, so uh, yeah, and I'm with uh, again with my good buddy here. Uh, uh, yeah, it's a really good game, really fun. So uh, yeah, let's go ahead and uh, rejoin him. All right, I'm back. Oops. Mm. I just clicked the mouse to get back into the game and shot uh, an arrow wildly. <laughs> <laughs> it was like um, tabbing out in uh, seven days and then you tab back in and shoot your gun. <laughs> it's like, ah, dang it. Man, look at them waves. Ugh. So good. Bam! Got some more feathers. Heard a deer. Right, you're over here somewhere. Oh, it is getting very dark over here. Yeah, it's pretty nasty where I'm at. Yeah. It's just like I look this way. I'm like, oh, that you know, darkness is not so bad. And then I look this way. And it's like pure just blackness over this way. because that's the sea. That's just nuts. <clears throat> that's another thing too is I'd like to be I'd like to live near the sea and have like a, a storm like this. <laughs> you know obviously not one that's gonna flood you out but <laughs> just yeah, just one that the true. the waves just splashing up against the coast and the thunder and lightning and things. Could be very peaceful. There's some more boars. Eventually, once we get a cartography t uh, table, we can uh, put our maps together. This is a really nice feature. And yes, it's a little bit annoying, but you can't just share maps right off the bat, but it's also a really, you know, they like, like, oh yeah, you could share maps, you just, uh, you just have to do this, which makes sense. <laughs> we have a table and we just draw out a new map from our two maps. Yeah. That's actually kind of cool. <laughs> I'm willing to forgive it. Because of that. Ooh, that lightning, that's very nice. <laughs> sea is trying to carry me away out here. Able to get all that. Yeah. Where'd that other deer go? A 
ran away. I had to get that deer, though. It was a one-star deer. Another one star deer. Bam. Man, we're going to have just from all this deer hunting, just so much meat. Yeah. <laughs> it's like when my uncle would go out a long time ago, years, many years ago. He had three freezers in his house. Two of them were stand-up freezers side by side, and then the other one was a deep freeze. And, yep, he would just go out and hunt deer and uh, bring it back, and cut it up, and uh, put it all in the freezers. <laughs> just fill them completely full. Never actually personally been deer hunting at all. Been coyote hunting. <laughs> that, there, there's a difference. <laughs> yeah, there's a big difference. <laughs> yeah, we had some drunk dumbasses coyote hunting out by my parents' house a little while back. They were just out chasing them in the middle of the night. All of a sudden, my parents just hear... Boom, boom, boom. It's like, what the fuck is going on? They just see lights careening down the side of the field, and it's like, okay. <laughs> they do crash. So the next day, my parents ask someone if they were out car and like, oh, yeah, no, oh, yada, yada, yada. And it's like, you could have let us know instead of driving through our field lighting off shots next to our house. Oh, sorry about that. Oh. You dumbass. Yeah. The reason I asked it, did they crash was because, you yeah, know, we, we would um, chase coyotes off of the farm out there. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, we did it with shotguns on four-wheelers. <laughs> <laughs> Chasing them down, man. Keeping them out of the livestock. Bam. It's another deer in the bag. Another notch on my bow. <laughs> uh, oh dear. There's a seagull up there. Just gotta get close enough for a decent shot. I missed. What the heck? Bam, there we go. I thought I was aiming dead on, but apparently I kept aiming to the left a bit. Uh -oh. well, there's another hut here as well. You got for me. Please, no bees. Okay, no bees. Uh, some more gold, flint, and another piece of amber. Mapping out the coast out this way. That's pretty far, too.
I also love how the storms in this game seem to be like, uh, what do they call it? Where the storms actually, they're actual storms, they're not like just scripted events. Mm hmm. Where they actually move. Dynamic weather? Yes. That's it. I see a storm over there, it looks like, on that other area, if that is a storm, or just clouds. Really low to the ground. <laughs> <laughs> very dark as well. It's very nice. Yeah, for such a low poly count game, this game can look damn good. <laughs> I need some range. Yeah, you got a bow. Yeah, I just haven't picked it up yet. Oh. Been out in the middle of nowhere. Near the house, but just not at it. Well, it's the only way to catch them seagulls, too. Is range. Which I've been trying to hunt as well, and that's why I'm mapping out the coast. Is Trying to catch them damn birds. That way I can, uh. Get some more feathers. But I'm also hunting deer, too. Oh, I'm at three arrows. I might as well head back. Boards as well. Nice. Ooh, sent some seagulls. Well, that, that, one, that one flew away, I guess, and I didn't see it. Oh, that one disappeared too. Just literally just up and disappeared. I seen it, and it just went poof. Last arrow. Last chance. Bam. I have 12 feathers. 3, 6, 9, 12. So that's 4 sets of arrows, which... That's 80 arrows. Yep, now I'm definitely heading back. more. There's another boy. Hey, you little bastard. I'm out of stamina. Come here. Yeah. 
That bird just flew through the ground. <laughs> just randomly. I also forgot that there was that structure that I didn't even look at. I have some good treasure in it. So that one's over this way. Next thing they need in this game is moving parts. That way I can finally build my dream building in this game. If I can build a... Uh, basically a mill. Ran mm -hmm. by water. have a chest in it. I don't think it does. Nope. <sighs> Sad. I was hoping for more feathers. I'll go this way a little bit now. Said that second hit didn't kill ya. Come back here. Now I'm chasing the deer across the landscape like a madman. Ooh, I think I found snow. I sure did. Probably don't want to chase the deer into this. Mushrooms. Yes. If I can sneak up on this deer. Oh my gosh, bit of lag there. Oh, another little structure. Oh, is this like a little chicken coop? That's what it looks like. Chicken coop. It's got fences. been to this structure yet. This little house. Oh, it just has a bed in it. I 
guess I'll head back. No, I said that already, but... Interesting going on over there. <laughs> no, no, <laughs> not really. Just going around looking for stuff. Nice. Anything good? Not really. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Working on my bow skill now. Mm. Hopefully we can get them birds. Yeah, I'm looking for some. I've only seen one or two. Yeah, they're not they're not very common, it seems. I think I've said this before, but I just really ha love how you just, you don't have to eat in this game. You can, and there's a lot of benefits to eating, but you don't have to. You're not going to mm -hmm. die from starving to death. <laughs> yep. Just one less thing that, you know, it's not, uh... not um, bothering you constantly. <laughs> the deer AI just decided to turn around and face me. And then I get a knife to the face. That's right, the trees kind of regrow. Come on, seagull, just stay right where you are. Right, you bastard. Oh, you didn't take the arrows out of the chest. Yeah, no, I made some wooden arrows, and you seem to be doing a little bit more, uh... Uh, not necessarily harder, but stuff like that. So I just made some quick wood ones. Oh, okay. You know. <laughs> right. Plus, I was just gonna be grinding, murdering shit, so... Well, that's what I was doing. I mean, I'm not really leveling up, like, you know, actively going after leveling up. I was just hunting birds and deer because we needed the hide and needed the feathers. Mm -hmm. And then um, attacking boars and anything else that would come towards me with the other stuff so I'm not wasting arrows. cooking all the meats. Oh yeah, I labeled one of my satisfactory videos after um, the uh, Arby's slogan. You know, the Arby's, we have the meats. And at that time, I had boxes and boxes of coal, so 
<laughs> it's like WSI, we have the coal. <laughs> Fucking hell. It's a stupid joke. now to actually put together some sets of armor. <coughs> the heck was that? Uh, a bird landed right outside. Nice. It did not survive. <laughs> those feathers. And uh, once we get a full set of armor, maybe we'll uh, gear up with a bunch of um, fire arrows and such. And, uh, See the deer? Yeah. See the Dear God. And dear God, is he gonna die? <laughs> <laughs> Terrible. <I know. sighs> it's like when you, you know, when you make a joke and even you sigh at it. <laughs> yep. <laughs> it's like, <sighs> I'm terrible. Once we get a pick, we can start getting some some ores and stuff. Get our way to the Black Forest. Make even better tools and armor. How much? Uh oh, that's a lot of lag. Wonder how much gold do you need to make a gold pile? Ninety-nine. Need ninety-nine coins to make a coin stack, and you need a nine hundred and ninety-nine coins to make a gold pile. Which is really funny. I like that they added that. Cause it was, what was it? Was it Fable Two? They had the wealth chamber. Where the uh, more... Yeah, it would have been two, I think. Yeah, where the more money you had, the more your wealth chamber filled up with gold, which was really cool. And I haven't ever... At least for me, I've never seen it in another game <laughs> that did that. And this game's just like, oh yeah, gold piles, here you go. It's like, oh... You're too kind. Oh yeah, and just recently, there's, um, in the mountains, the mountain regions, there's, uh, ice caves that you can go into. Which have cool, cool treasures and stuff. It's just another type of, it's a really cool dungeon. You, like, break your way in. And there's, uh, harder monsters and stuff in there, but... If you're prepared for it, there's some really good treasure to be found. Alright, let's make this armor. I think I have all the... Did you put all your deer hides and stuff in the box here? I did not, but I'm right here. Okay. I just killed a one-star deer. <laughs> that died in the water. 
So everything's there in the water and I can't get it. Yeah, sad. If you just want to drop off your, your height and your scraps and... Uh, we'll make some armor. Um, let's see here. Leather helmet. Craft. Alright, so in this chest here, there's a full set of leather armor. Actually, how much does it take to upgrade? Upgrade it to level 2. Uh, oh, we need bones. We need bone fragments. Okay, well. Level 1 leather armor in this chest here. Full set. and stuff. Right. Yeah. Got a kitty on your chest. Yep. Oh, don't forget to grab your leather armor before you hit out. <laughs> actually. <laughs> arrows a piece. Keep these as backup. Okay, I'll put that in there. That in there. I'll put these in there. Deer trophies in there. Actually, mushrooms are better. Okay, put that in there, that in there, and that in there. Don't need that. So yeah, whenever you're ready, just uh, come get some fire arrows and uh, we'll take them on. Yeah, let me uh, come back real quick. Yeah, you'll have to anyway. It's 
actually perfect timing too. It's nice and nice and daylight out. Probably best to eat it now, so you can heal up. <laughs> yeah. Got the deer trophies? Uh, no, they should be over there. It's like that's what I was looking for, but I opened the chest and immediately blanked on what I was looking for, so it's just standing there. Okay. And I believe we only need three. So I'll just take the three. leave all my tools behind just in case put a chest so put another chest down Your tools I think it might be a good idea though <laughs> leave all, leave all the tools behind Seven, and eight. Equip the fire arrows. Okay, I'm ready to go now. So the only thing I got in my inventory is a bit of food, my armor, and my bow. At least he won't be able to go trampling off. It's gonna be. Uh, I think it's gonna be a little hard to fight him. <laughs> <In this Yeah. laughs> There's not many places to actually go. Oh, that's right. You need it on your hot bar. Oh, so there's only two. Okay. Well, that's whatever. It's only two trophies. Let's go. Yes. Oh, that 
of stamina. Oh yeah, we were more than well prepared for that fight. <laughs> So we got three antlers. I mean, oh, I don't have. I should have brought four to get trophies. I was like, we could fight them again and get some more antlers. <laughs> <laughs> I can go put his head on the plinth. Deer trophy. Get some more antlers from that. on me. Back we go. <laughs> I'm a coming. Oh, perfect. Perfect weather. Got me in the corner. <laughs> Ow. Bastard. I'm like using the rocks as like blocking his path. Gain stamina if you're chasing me all the time. <laughs> hey. Very nice, very nice. Now you got antlers, right? Yep. I figured since it's in the beach and 
want to grab this this can. Nice. Yep. Huh. All right. We got a trophy. Yep. Got another trophy. That way, with that one, we can hang on the wall. I think. If we had a trophy thing. Put away my flint knife, but oh well. Ah, that actually didn't take as many arrows as I thought it was going to. Now we can go forth and strike the earth. So, uh, what's his face says? When you build it. Oops. I'll right, take half that. And those antlers. Antler pickaxe. I couldn't remember how many antlers it took, but. Luckily, it's only one, so we have some spare. In case we lose any. That in there, put that in there. Alright, sweet. Again, I'll be right back. Alrighty. Well, that was a fun episode, wasn't it? And, uh, yeah. We got to fight the first boss. Actually, it wasn't all that hard. Not as hard as I remember it being. So, uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's for now, and, uh, we'll have some more fun next time. Here in Valheim. Bye.